sounds like the birds are trying to call the sun up. <laughs> Anything would be better than this. Well, the little ones are off for the day. Time to make some coffee and then get the last one out. He doesn't leave until about 7.30. It's not a very nice day, is it? Y'all got mush everywhere. This is an uh oh egg. Clean and little. Hi, dude. <laughs> Good. Hey, guys. So, my house is freezing cold because it's ridiculous. This weather is insane. It's 63 in the house because the heat is on 63. We actually had the heat set to 63 because it wasn't cold in the house and now it's freaking freezing in the house. But that being said, I went to Goodwill today and I got some goodies. Now there was one item that I wasn't really sure if I wanted. Look, I look so crazy. I have all my workout gear on and then I had to go help the hubby move the refrigerator <laughs> off the truck and it's freezing. So I went to go throw this on and then it was cold in the house. So I just left it on. So I'm looking, I'm looking crazy. Anyway, this gorgeous, gorgeous baby look at it so it's a got got cool vintage galvanized metal drink dispenser it's so neat i got it for 25 bucks i usually don't pay like full price for my, for many things but i thought it was so cool and you know if you get a drink dispenser like this galvanized you know whatever you're gonna pay about 20 to 30 bucks something like that or you're gonna get a decorative decorative one for like 29.99 $39 and it's just you know whatever so I thought vintage it's a legit drink dispenser it's lined with polythylene whatever that is and it's fully functional I absolutely love this I thought it was the coolest thing ever and they actually put it up on the shelf in Goodwill when I was leaving and I just like cut a corner and went straight to it, picked it up and got it because I thought this was so awesome. The guys love it as my, the hubby and our friend, they love it. They're like, yeah, in the spring, you know, at the pool with lemonade and tea and all that good stuff. I love, see, that's what I love. I love whenever I find cool things, my friends can think of things that we're just going to like do with them. I mean, I think that is so cool. So. They were excited about this. It's really cool. And it's a really good size. It's about a foot, I say about a foot and a half-ish maybe, a foot and eight inches, something like that. Not including the handle height. I don't know, but it's a five gallon, so that's really good. If you saw one of my recent thrift store hauls, you would have seen that I got the Lenox China Stone dishware. 
and the little sets with the plate, the bowl, the mug, and then like a small plate or something, like a salad plate. I don't know. It was like three or four pieces. And I waited for these and I was so happy. And now I have another regret. So if you watched that haul, you saw that I snapped in the, in the video that I got an extra one for a reason and I couldn't remember when I was at the register, so I put it back. They didn't have it, unfortunately. But they did have the plates and I'm regretting it now because the Lenox China Stone with the blue pinstripe used sell eight for a hundred dollars on eBay like sell sold recently as in February so I got a set of six yellow tag was 50% off so I got six of them for three bucks I mean you can't be mad at that right I know. anyway so I was really happy with those the hubby said we could stop by tomorrow and see if they have them if they do we'll pick them up and I'll sell them eventually I don't know the guys are outside right now working on the four-wheelers the hubby went on a buying spree of all four-wheeler pieces and things that they're going to be putting on them to kind of you know just update them and get them nice and ready to ride when this weather clears up this is insane this is insane but for now that's what i got see you guys in a bit hey guys so i'm a little out of breath i just carried all this crap but awesome finds today at kroger oh my hair looks crazy awesome finds today at kroger so i got this I'm pretty sure I already gave it to her because, you know, everything goes up later in a vlog. This, this is all Kroger. So this was marked down from $40. It's a copper three-quart mixer for $12. Oh my gosh. And then for us, I got this. This is a mini chopper. Adorable. Check that out. I believe this one is, I don't know. I don't know. But the whole theme of this thing was... Uh, it comes, it's a box inside of a box with a bow and everything's in here so you can wrap it to make it look like a gift and that is so cute. Anyway, for 12 bucks, yes please, it was $40. So I got that. My next favorite thing, we got some chicken eggs. Oh my goodness, one of our chickens passed last night. It's never an easy thing, never, especially because we had no clue there was anything wrong with this one. She was perfectly normal walking around I was literally just outside with her and she went to sleep and didn't wake up. It was insane. But anyway, the hubby took care of her. He buried her and you know, so we got eggs in here. Um, there's five eggs in there and then some medicine. We've been treating them because this weather is ridiculous. It's making them nonstop sick. So anyway, moving on to these bowls. This is a 12 quart bowl here, this big one. They had it tagged for $6.99. I was excited about that because they're like $14 a bowl. I was excited about that. So I got one of each and then got to the front and they rang up for $3.90 for a 12 quart bowl. That is amazing. And then these were $3 and then the one inside there was $2 and change. It was pretty freaking awesome. So I was super excited about that. It's our anniversary today. So this bag, this bag has anniversary stuff snacks in it I'll work on that later so the next cool cool thing well of course if you're a grown-up you know it's cool so they had these towels there $10 home elements bath towels 100% cotton for $2 I mean really $2 and they're a great quality super cute and simple looking so I got four for us and it was perfect timing because the towels at Ikea are $4 a piece. And we were actually going to get some more for the boys because theirs have already gotten, you know, bleach stains and crap on them. So I got them eight of these so they can have it, uh, have enough to cycle out. So that was really awesome. That's $80 in towels for 16 bucks. That's, that's just great. Okay, so I'm upstairs in the house now. And I've set up the little gift here for my friend or friends. So... It's our anniversary, and I know when she walks in, she's gonna be like, her eyes are gonna get all big, and she's gonna do this like tight mouth, like baby wanna cry thing that she always does when she gets excited for me or us. So, I'm gonna have it like this so she thinks that it was an anniversary gift to moi, when in reality, it's gonna be for her. And I'm so excited, so excited. So it's super adorable. It has, uh, four tools this thing locks it has six 
Uh, let's see if you can see it. It has six speed settings. Cool thing, really cool, because I have a mixer, but it doesn't do this. So under here, there's this lock. You can lock the base in place, and you can use this to shift it from side to side. Oop, I dropped the book. From side to side, depending, oh, it comes further, but side to side, depending on, I guess, like where you're using it or what. It comes with a really cool recipe book and like little things that you can do with it. So that's pretty awesome. I thought it was really cute since we get together a lot and we do a lot of cooking together and we do a lot of like spontaneous feed the entire family and there's 11 of us together. Uh, feed the, no, 12. There's 12 of us together. So we get a lot of like feed the family together after we've had like 20,000 missions in a day. If you've been watching the vlogs or you follow me on social media, you know that like they go through some ish with us out here in the country, okay? Anyway, this is my thought process. She's been dying for a mixer and he loves copper. So now it's the perfect fit for both of them. It's not super ginormous because they have a small family. It's not super ginormous and this will work. And yesterday they made us a carrot cake. Look at this, beautiful carrot cake. They made us a carrot cake and they were mixing it by hand. I thought, what, what fun. And then the little one, Maddie, y'all seen her in the vlogs, Maddie, she baked one and Bridget baked one. And Maddie's little hands were mixing the batter and stuff. So now this is something that Maddie can actually, you know, be in the kitchen and helping mommy use. So I'm super excited. I know it's just a freaking $40 mixer that I found for 12 bucks, but just the purpose and the reasoning behind it is why I'm so excited. So there's that. And then this is my, my chopper. This one was $40 also. Let's see if I can get it in closer. Okay, so this one was $40 also and they had it marked down for 12 bucks. Like that is freaking awesome. It's not locked on there. That's why it looks all kind of wonky, but there you go. It is so beautiful. So I'm super excited to play with this. But for now, I'm going to make us some, uh, what time is it? It's 1.30, so I'm gonna make us some brunch and we're about to enjoy ourselves before the kiddos get home and it becomes a hectic day. Okay, so what I've done here is I took pita bread and all veggie spread it has like eggplant, garlic, all kinds of yummy stuff, peppers and stuff in it. And I've layered it on there kind of like a breakfast pizza, the hubby said. Put some scrambled eggs over that and then tomatoes and cilantro and then I threw it into the toaster oven real quick and threw on some feta. And I seasoned it with black cracked pepper and purple sea salt. And then you do this. <laughs> and the hubby said it turned from a breakfast pizza to a breakfast burrito. <laughs> Delicious. Yummy? Mmm. Yummy. Hey guys, so putting together a basket. We're about to leave. I'm gonna put together some of the pita bread, feta cheese things that I've been doing lately. And I got some delicious goodies to throw together. So in this basket, I already have some wine, pink Moscato that I already had open. Magazine that I'm gonna pass on to Bridget. Here I have some olive bruschetta. It's basically a fruity and zesty combination of olives and that's awesome. That's the hubby's favorite. Um, Mitzi loves them too, so we're gonna put that on there. And then I got some of these delicious roasted red potato tomatoes lots of delicious flavor so that's going to be delicious and then instead of the cilantro i'm going to chop up some of this fresh basil and throw that on there and i think it's going to be awesome she has a toaster oven in fact the reason i bought a toaster oven is because she had one and i loved it so we're about to head out and go enjoy ourselves some dinner with friends so i wanted to show you guys something you know your friends love you. Oh, don't mind this wall, it's being torn out. You know your friends love you. When the wine refrigerator is full of your wine that they bought for you. How thoughtful is that? So sweet. Nope. Try his um, buttons. Nope. Try his watch.
No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is. It's right here. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Right, 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 right. there. to get a battery for my four-wheeler and we came out of the store and we're on our way to go have dinner if we ever get there because there's this this we're gonna be here for a minute Okay guys, so if any of you know Cody, he's one of the Bates pups. He's a runner and he will haul it until you come all the way out and put a leash on him and walk him in. Because only then does he know that it's time to go inside. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get over there and see what it looks like. Be very careful because there's a lot of glass. I need a lot. Look, you threw it away. Cut yourself? Well, you got to be careful. Cool. Maddie, stay back from the water, please. Until your mommy gets here. They're trying to get the four-wheeler out. Mom, look, it's good. Maddie, very carefully, please. I know. I 
So the fellas had to take some of the four-wheelers and go around because one of them got stuck. We were trying to come up a very steep area, but of course, as you guys know, <laughs> it's been super rainy, so there's mud everywhere. So it's kind of, it makes things a lot harder than what they could be. It sounds like things are going okay. That's glass. Stop grabbing everything. Look. This is a cool one. Yeah. Found something cool. Yeah. But now we're just walking around. We already hiked through everything to get down here. It's at least a good 40, 45, 50 feet. Not bad with a bunch of kiddos. <laughs> These little kids are crazy, man, I tell you. Water runs right here. Come on, guys. This is the coolest looking sand, baby. Just take a picture of that. Looks like that's Because like no it's partially shrimp. dry. I'm careful because it's all it's all wet, so it's gonna be like quicksand going the dry spots. Mm. There's a dog or a deer or something there. Right there. Maybe a coyote. Oh yeah. Definitely a coyote. Footprint sunk. You probably shouldn't go that way. Oh God. Who went this way already? That was already here. Don't go right here. Hey. Careful because you'll sink. Hey, why do the footprints go to the water and they don't come back? <laughs> dun, hey. dun, dun. They only go that way. They probably swam yeah. across and went out. That's a person. On the other side. Hey. Yeah. They're not going to swim. Oh, well, I'm pretty I sure. Swim. They're out here by themselves. They're ready to swim. Or a boat. Maddie said, that was crazy. Where did he... Right? He's like, I gotta save myself. On the black, Mama. On the black. Maddie's so light that she can't even see. This way, Mama. Come here. Maddie, hey, on the rocks. Start walking fast when you start sinking. Oh, gosh. This is one of them, too. Yeah. Cool. Hey. This way, Maddie. Get on the rocks. I found the whole one. Okay, so did Aiden. Calm down. I just saw the tongue I found the whole one. Wow. Y'all, dinner. Yay. Wait, can we actually so make this Look, this one has... That's why you have to open them. Let's open them for this. Oh, Daddy. Is that fun? Oh, yeah. Daddy, this one... Oh, yeah. Daddy, this one... Oh, yeah. Daddy, this one... 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 adventure yes. <laughs> you look like you had a, a good time yes yes I did <laughs>
So how was it, bud? Fun. Was it fun to be responsible for the go-kart the whole way? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Can I In still ride it? Words. Like on the street? I, I don't know it? where they went. No, I think they that's... Went, they went behind. We got dinner and stuff to do, so I think it's... Showers are next.